Redlining is a form of editing in which red ink is used to indicate removal or addition of text in Microsoft Word. So if you ever want to know how to redline a document in Microsoft Word, make sure to keep watching on this video. Now in doing this, open the document you wish to edit, click the Review tab in the top toolbar, click Track Changes option to enable track changes, open the drop-down menu next to Track Changes, select All Markup, click the Show Markup option, click the Show Markup drop-down menu, and click some of the options there. Now you have to highlight some text, then click New Comment in the Comment section of the toolbar, and this feature will allow you to add feedback into the highlighted text. Now your feedback will appear in the right-hand edits bar. So after you have edited your document, click Accept to save your changes. And whenever you delete or add a character, Microsoft Word will place a vertical red line next to the line of text in which the edit was made. Now another way to redlining manually the document by opening the document you wish to edit, click the Home tab, find the Strike Through option, find the font color, then click and drag the mouse cursor over an unwanted section of the text to highlight. Click Strike Through to place a line through the highlighted text and make sure that there is a space between the end of your Strike Through and the next word. Then place your cursor at the end of the space after the Strike Through text Click the font color, add your replacement text after the strike through text, and make sure any additions are in your editing color, and repeat the steps until your document is completely edited. So those are the two ways on how you can redline a document in your Microsoft Word. If you found this video helpful, kindly like and subscribe. You may also click and turn on the notification bell so you can be notified from whenever we release new videos.